there, it's Carly Vinsagara and I'm alive! I am so sorry I haven't posted in so long, but life has been very crazy lately and I'm here now. That's all that counts, right? Okay, this video is very exciting and uh, so let's just get on with it. So, we all know that the only reason that girls even wear makeup is to impress boys. So, I thought that today I would just show y'all a little bit of how boys actually like our makeup to be. Because, you know, if we're only wearing it for them, then we want to make sure that they're happy with the way that we look. So, follow these tips and tricks, my ladies, and you'll get all the fellas you want. Let's get started. So, first off, we gonna start with some moisturizer, any kind will do, but you know, helps prevent acne, and boys hate acne, so if you have acne, don't even try. You can stay in your house, because I mean, you ain't gonna get nowhere. So let's start here. Okay, I think that's great. Now we're gonna move on to foundation, because you know, you have to cover up your entire face, because I mean, <laughs> If you have uneven skin tone or some kind of weird stuff going on, like, ew, no one wants to see that. Um, I've never actually tried this before, don't know if it works. I think it's too light for my skin tone, but you know, like, if I look too light, like a kind of ghostly look, I'll like blend in and like, you know, that's okay. So, I mean, you know, it's all right, it's all good. So, um, I don't know. Perfect. Okay, now that our face is completely covered and we have like a blanket over our face, hiding all of our interior feelings and emotions, we can just cover it up even more with some concealer because, you know, if we look sleep deprived or if we look, you know, any imperfection at all is on our face, like boys immediately turn away from that. They're like, uh, no, she's not perfect. Um, I'm gonna go find someone else with a better looking face. So, because you know, looks, are everything these days so you know just a little concealer you know in case you didn't get sleep i mean that's okay you can just use concealer it's like instant sleep okay that looks good next you're going to want to powder your face when it all sets in because you know if you look too dewy it looks like plastic and you know you want to make sure that you have an equal balance between looking plastic and not looking original so so you're gonna want to powder your face <clears throat> just like that beauty is pain okay so just like you know wipe your extra stuff okay perfect so now you might be worried oh my gosh I look too white now and you know that's not good um, we're gonna make sure that we have a nice glow to our skin as well, you know, because if you live inside all day, I mean, it shows like maybe you weren't exercising or something. So, you know, if you're outside, it shows that you like are into exercise and stuff, you know, because guys are totally into that. And if you don't exercise or stay healthy, then guys will not like you. So, let's add, you know, some like warmth to our face. You know, let's add some uh, bronzer. And, you know, I kind of just put this like all over. Okay, this one isn't giving me like the dark enough coverage I want. So um, I'm gonna see if this one's darker. Okay, I think that looks good. Let me close that. Perfect. So next we're gonna like contour, which is where you just make, you know, these like certain parts of your face like darker than the others because I mean, we look good now, but we need to look a little bit, uh, you know, more drastic. Cause you know, again, the guys like and you know we gotta stick to their standards be a little more right here if it doesn't like look dark enough you can always use your finger and what contouring is great for is it makes your face look skinnier and you know gotta shave off of extra pounds I mean our looks are purely for the boys and they like you know a nice trim face so really gotta make sure that you slim off those extra pounds by just contouring I mean who needs fruits and vegetables when you can just contour every morning done yep okay that looks perfect so next what we're gonna do is we're gonna highlight because you know of course gotta highlight I mean it'd be silly if we didn't highlighting is awesome because it makes you look you know nice and shiny maybe you just 
working out, you have some sweat going, but it's like, ooh, it's a pretty shimmery sweat. But also, like, it's not that gross. So, I mean, well, I guess it is, but it depends on your fella. So, we're gonna go in with uh, this uh, highlighter here. You can just kind of do all of them, basically. Because, you know, I gotta, gotta be good. Okay, again, another great opportunity to use your finger. And if your highlight ain't popping, don't expect to get all the boys because it's what they love, trust me. Also, keep in mind, if you don't use the right brands, all of this is for nothing. Because, you know, name brands are super important. Like, you can totally tell that I use all the right brands on my face because it's so obvious. So make sure you're really using those high-end, expensive brands. If you don't have enough money, I mean, eh, you're out of luck, sorry. Okay, that looks good to me. It's progress. Okay, the next is blush. So blush kind of brings it all back now to natural, you know, like the, brings out the essence of the natural blush in your cheeks. So you wanna go to a color that's like similar to the natural rose color in your cheek, if that makes sense. If it's too hard for you to figure out, it's okay. But I mean, we're not all perfect, so. But you want a lot of blush. Trust me, again, it's what the boys like. Gotta get that finger in there. And your finger really gets a lot of the pigment on there. Cause you know, sometimes your brushes just don't understand that like, you're doing your makeup for boys, so you need a lot on there. Okay, so much better. Gosh, glad I used my finger. Okay. I think we're done with our face. So this is the final product of your face. Make sure it looks just like this. Okay, next we're gonna move on to eyes. I forgot eyebrows. How embarrassing, oh my gosh, can you believe if I went out like this, but I didn't have eyebrows? People would think I was crazy. So, you're gonna take um, an eyebrow color. First, you're gonna brush it through, because I mean, if you don't brush it through, you're gonna look crazy, so. Let me tell you a little first. Boys like very, very good eyebrows, so if you mess up, Start over because it's not even worth it. Looks good to me, yeah? Okay, good. And it's like okay if they're not the same shape. Because I mean, <laughs> they're boys, they don't pay that much attention. But they do have to be perfect. Take notes. Okay, moving on. I can't believe I almost forgot that. Okay, next we're gonna move on to eyeshadow. So I'm gonna take a really natural palette. You want something, you know, very similar to like, you know, your own natural eye colors. So, you know, something like this. I'm gonna take a nice transition color and um, pop it in the lid, you know, something nice and um, something nice and subtle, you know, something uh, really, um, that will, you know, blur out the whole effect. Just goes right in the lid. It's a nice transition shade. That actually looks pretty good already. Okay, then um, I want to some shimmer in there so that they can notice me because you know you're always gonna try to like get as much attention as possible and like you know show them that you know like so they know. Oh, she's there. So get some nice shimmer going. Because if you don't, then what's the point of it all? So you can like really see that now, it really pops. But this is just like a more of a day look. So if you're gonna go for a night look, you probably wanna pick bolder colors, um, obviously. So I just wanna let you know though, uh, in case you want to wear this at night, don't know why you would do that. I mean, you can't even see it at night. So that's why you need really bold colors at night. Nothing like this. Lastly, we're gonna finish it off. Oh my gosh, I almost forgot mascara. I keep forgetting everything. Gosh, it looks so silly though. So again, you're gonna want mascara that's like um, really expensive. You don't want anything cheap because you can really tell when you use cheap stuff. It's really obvious. Um, and we're gonna make sure the reason that we use mascara is so that our lashes are really long because guys like long eyelashes. If you have short lashes, mm, you should probably get lash extensions and spend a lot of money in making them look longer and better so that everyone thinks your eyelashes are naturally that way because if you have short eyelashes, like what's What's the point? <laughs> and you know, can't forget those bottom lashes. 
last. Then we're gonna finish off this amazing look with a nice, bold lip. So this is like, you know, a nice calling to the boys because, you know, the lips are what it's all about. So you wanna get something really, really nice and out there. Um, but this is also something that you can wear for, you know, day to day. So you wanna try to find that transition of something bold, but also daily wearing. I think that that is it. We're done. So, this is what you have to do every single morning of your life and for the rest of your life, ladies, in order to get boys to like you. It's easy as that. Boys are attracted to this, and you know, makeup is all about the way boys want to feel, and it doesn't matter how you feel at all. If you feel really ugly in this, it doesn't matter, because the only thing that matters in life is how other people think of you. Okay, if you couldn't tell, that was a joke. I want to make sure that no one's feelings are hurt, and if you already typed like some like, yeah, like frustrated comment down below, just know I'm not actually attacking anyone or trying to be rude to anyone. This is all for good fun. Um, I just kind of wanted to show y'all that um, you don't need to do anything to make anyone else happy but yourself. Um, so. The reason I love makeup is because it makes me feel pretty, makes me feel confident, and I wear it for myself. And I feel like, I know, a really big misconception these days is that, you know, girls only wear makeup for boys, and that is far from the truth, and so I just wanted to make this little video. This is not my idea, actually. I got it from someone else. If I can find the original video, which I don't know if I remember it or not, but if I can find it, I'll put it down below and you can go check it out. And this was all for good fun, and I hope no one was offended. I hope you just were able to laugh at it because that's what the goal was here. Okay, now on to my weekly favorites. My song of the week is gonna be Swalla by Jason Derulo. It's like a really bad song, but for some reason it's been stuck in my head a lot lately. I don't know, it's really bad. Don't listen to it, but it'll be down below in case you do. And I have not been on YouTube like a lot lately. I just like haven't really been on YouTube that much. I've really been on Netflix finishing up Glee. I'm almost done. Oh, it's such a good show, I don't want it to end, but as soon as it is, I'm sure I'll be right back on YouTube and I'll be all over it, and then I'll have a YouTuber for the week. But again, my you top tuber this week is just gonna be Glee, uh, and that'll be down below as well. I'm pretty sure that's all I have to say. Oh, subscribe for a new video every Saturday, but probably not for the next couple of weeks, and then it will be every Saturday once summer comes. Uh, See ya!